Hey guys, Splappa09 Gaming here, and we are back on Valheim. Um, we we've got, as you can see, we've got full arm iron armor. Um, we went over to here and cleared out all of the crypts on this little small swampland area. But because we did that, we were able to unlock another location for bone mass right here. Now, that's still a pretty good distance. But it's a shorter distance than this one. So I think that one is the one that I'm going to go use. Also, we did a couple more crypts here. So we got a crap ton of iron. But we also explored the rest of the swamplands here and marked all of these things. So when we need more iron, this is what we can do. So we've got, if you look closely here... We've got crypts. We've got these are the Draugr spawners right here, or skeleton spawners. These two right here are the Sertling spawners, the little fire geysers. Those are cool. Um, you can actually kite those abomination tree things over the top of them, and those abominations aren't too bright. They'll just sit there and take damage, a lot of damage because it's fire. But anyway, one of the things I need to do, I've got this. I've got this stuff on me right now, but. I want to upgrade the banded shield. <clears throat> Alright, now that that's max level. I want to make myself an iron pickaxe. Oh, also, the reason why I couldn't make an armor stand yet, because I hadn't made iron nails. But as you can see, I've got my iron armor upgraded all the way to level 4. We've got the Iron Mace upgraded all the way to level 4. I also have made some Iron Head arrows. So now we've got the Iron... Let's see. The pickaxe. Let's just upgrade that as many times as we can. Oh, needs some more. Needs some more iron. But also, let's dump... That's my old school stuff. This is all the bronze stuff here. I also would like to make a Huntsman Bow. Um, oh, I still not carrying enough. That should be max quality for that. Nice. Now I'd like to craft myself an Iron Axe. And I need more iron. Again. So we're just going to keep putting all of our bronze stuff in here, just in case I need to make a corpse run. There's no reason to get rid of it yet. It's good armor. And you see how much iron we had and how quickly we just went through it? Yep, still not enough to upgrade the axe fully, but we've almost got full iron equipment. The next thing I'd like to make is where is it the huntsman bow we just need some more iron let's put all this down here <clears throat> i just need some more iron and some feathers but i think i've yeah i do have a bunch of iron still oh that's already you know see these just must need coal yeah luckily I have. Luckily, I've got this storage room over here. Where I've got some coal piles right here, so... Oh, there's some iron right here, too. Nice. I don't know why I left it over here. I was probably getting more wood, and I was carrying too much. Uh, let's go put that iron down in here. And we're going to get these things cranking. Also, I have been making some of the meads, or the mead bases, so that I can ferment them into the mead. <coughs> uh, oh, is this one done? Sweet. 
That's good, because this is my, um, poison resist. So I have six poison resist, six of the, um, healing meads, the medium, and then six of the minor stamina meads. I've got some more poison resist ones here, some more healing ones here. Let's throw another one of the healing ones in there. I might want to make another fermenter, just because... But on the cooked foods, I'm almost done with these right here. The, uh, the lower level foods, and I can get 10 of these here. Alright, so um, once I get some more iron smelted, I'll bring you guys back. Alright, we've got enough to make the Huntsman Bow, just not to upgrade it all the way. But I am going to make it. And then, actually, I can upgrade it once. I need more iron. Uh, everything else I do have. So let's go put this bow in here with that set. All right, we don't quite have enough iron. I don't want to wait any longer for the iron. I can get that later off camera. I'll smelt all that down. Well, we do have this and this. And then let's get our... <clears throat> let's see, what are we going to pick up? Yeah, let's get all of these. And actually, one more thing. Cooked foods. We're going to get one, uh, one stack of each of these. Alright, what I need to do is I need to make... Let's see, is one of these labeled bone mass? That one is right there. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to break that down and get all that stuff. And that'll be enough to make a portal over there. Because I want to travel... I want to travel all the way out here to Bone Mass. Get a portal down. So I can go back and forth. And I'm going to go get this boat. Because what I'm going to do is I'm going to portal over to this right here, get closer, and then go to bone mass. Yeah, see guys, there's the fish right there. And then they've been, what I was doing was I was, they would just jump out. I might have make, made it too deep for them to do that now, but they would just be all over the place on land, just littered everywhere. All right, we we're ready to go to... Trader, Swamp. I think it's Swamp 2 that I need to go to. Or is Swamp 2 the other one? I don't remember how I named them. We'll figure it out in just a second. Yeah, this is the wrong one. So it's lowercase Swamp. Alright, now I can get this out and put the carve down. Unfortunately, we're going into the wind, so there's no way around how slow we're going. Alright, I am super close. Uh, right there somewhere. And now I have leeches following me. Get out of here. Can't see anything. And now it's dark. Might have to get out right here and put a portal down. Yeah, I think that's what I might have to do. Whoa, what, what is this right here? Alright, where is bone mass? Is that it right there? Yeah. 
Please stop. Really? I can hear that tree walking around, that abomination. I'm just going to level out the ground here. All right, here we go, guys. Oh, so I can block him just about. Oh, there's no way. Well, I have poison resist, so that's good. Man, they're right. This mace does real well. So when he throws those, that's when the blobs come out. And then sometimes they come out of his throw up. Nice. Oh, oh, took a major hit from that one. It's all right. We've got the, uh, let's just keep kiting him around this thing. There we go. There we go. Come on, let's get some health back. Ooh. How did it... Man, he's got a... Man, he's got some reach. Oh, shoot. Are we going to die? Nope. But we're going to get close. Come on. Let's just kite him around. Is he regenerating his health? I don't think so.
There we go. Come on. There we go. Let's get out of there. Let's not get thrown up on. Oh. Okay, so he, he can get me with that one. There it is. Now let's get a couple of smacks. There we go. Let's get a couple more. Back off. All right. There we go. If we're smart about this, we should be able to get this pretty easy. Oh. Oh, come on. Let's kill these things right immediately. No need to wait. Oof. Let's get him. There we go. We got him again. So that's that bit. Almost out of time, that one, right? There we go. I got a parry bonus on that one. Come on. Let's get out of there. We don't need to get thrown up on. Of course, I don't feel rested anymore. You guys see what I'm doing? Yep, let's get out of there. Oh. We don't want to take any more hits like that. Get him. There we go.
All right. And it is nighttime, and that's not good because, you know, the swamp. But I'm going to call it there, guys. I'm going to go back to my portal, and I'm going to head back. And uh, what do you want, Huggin? Yeah, I know. I uh, Yeah, I know. Locate the silver veins. I get it. All right. No, now get out of my face. But yeah, I'm gonna I'm gonna head back, get all this stuff sorted, get some more iron and stuff going because you know we're gonna need it, and then um, we're gonna head into the mountains because actually one of the things I got to do first is ne beginning of next episode. What I'll do is I'll go hang the bone mass trophy where it's uh, where it's supposed to be. All right, cool. But anyway, guys. Thank you for the support. Thank you for, thank you for always, you know, keep. Thank you for always pushing me. Um, I'm glad you guys enjoy watching this, and I enjoy making it. But um, again, you can follow me on uh, Twitter at Splapa09 Gaming. I've got the links to all those in the description of the video. Also, my Patreon and my merch store. Um, all those are in the link to, um, of the video, and it's all going to be the links in my uh, description on my YouTube channel. But other than that, guys, much love, and I will see you in the next episode.